Hey everybody, thank you so much for tuning in to another video from Broke Girl Investing. Today, I'm gonna to be talking about why I waited so long to start investing. In this short video, I'm gonna be talking about two things. One, why I waited so long to start investing, and two, why I'm not waiting any longer. First topic, why did I wait so long to invest? Long story short, I was stupid. I was too busy not listening to people who knew what they were talking about. I was busy partying it up. I was busy spending my money on things that I thought were important, like alcohol, clothes, debt. I was busy throwing my money, wasting it away on going out to eat, expensive apartments, and again, clothes. Now, when I was younger, I was actually a hairdresser. And if there's by chance any hairdressers out there listening, then you guys would understand at the end of the day, you usually go home with a fat wad of cash tips, right? And I was a hairdresser for a long time. So frequently I had a lot of cash on me and I did have people telling me, Hey, you should invest that you should invest. And I was like, nah, I don't think I'm going to do that. No, I took that money and I saw, I saw fun nights out at the club. You know, I saw that money and I saw, Ooh, new shoes. You know, I saw that money and I thought, Oh, I can get a new phone. Like that's what I saw in my twenties and some of my thirties. You know, aside from being young and dumb and making stupid decisions with my money, another reason that I didn't invest, I, I mean, I always heard it was always in my ear, invest, 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 but I, I just didn't listen. But another reason that I didn't invest because I felt I was, as a hairdresser, I knew that's not what I wanted to be for the rest of my life. That's not the career path I wanted to take. So I always thought, okay, whenever I get out of hairdressing and I start, you know, making more money, like real money, that's when I'll start investing. I always had this, okay, when I get to a, a better position in life, when I get a house in life, when I get so and so and so in life, then I'll start investing. But truth be told, you can't do that. That's called, what is that called? So, oh, Jim, I think Jim Rohn, Jim Ron, I think Jim Ron said people get stuck on some someday aisle, like someday I'll do this and someday I'll do that and someday I'll do this and legitimate. I was that in my younger days. I always put off things that I knew I should have been doing because I was too busy thinking I knew everything. Okay. So that clears up why I didn't invest because I thought I was high and mighty and I thought I was invincible. Now, the reason why I'm not waiting anymore. I don't even know where to start. I'm tired. I want nicer things in life. I don't want to work anymore. I want passive income. I want the life that I want to live. So many reasons, right? And it's like I wanted those things in my early days, but I just didn't have a clue how to get it. And I just didn't put any work into it. And honestly, I had a self-worth problem and a self-esteem. I didn't think I could be one of those persons. It took a long, long, long time to figure it out. I didn't have, and partially my fault, I didn't hang around with a very good crowd. I didn't have a lot of good influences around me. And even if I did, I probably shooed them off because... I was a little messed up. I just don't want to wait. In, I can't wait any longer. I get angry at myself thinking, oh my God, if I, if I make a paycheck and I don't put just a little bit away towards investing, I get super mad at myself now. It's, I'm, I'm like a completely different opposite person than I was in my younger days. So despite starting this investment journey in my late thirties, yes, it kind of makes me cringe, but I know that there are people out there who have started later. Um, there are people out there right now around my age that are thinking about starting. And I just want to say, do it now. And for anybody who happens to be younger watching this video and, you know, investing is in the back of your mind, 
You know, you don't want to get to your late 30s or 40s, 50s, retiring age and realize, oh my gosh, I wasted so much time. So yeah, better late than never. That's why I waited so long to start investing. I hope you guys enjoyed this short video. Hope everybody's having a great new year, a new 2022. And I hope y'all are being kind to one another. I'll catch you in the next video. Take care.